Uh, you know, I think that we've been um, we've been consistent in our energy uh, and and our pursuit, and I think that uh, you know we're throwing a, a lot better right now than we have been. Um, so I think defensively we're playing way way better, um, which is ke keeping us in ball games and giving us an opportunity to win some. What do you expect going to expect out of Texas? You know, I think that they throw well. They have two pitchers, um, you know, that were look to do really good this year in conference. And I think they have a, a, a different kid that's run for them well, too. So I think that they'll be well in the circle. I think they hired a new hitting coach. So um, they're adapting to his style right now. And, uh, and you know, maybe not being as powerful in their lineup as they'd want to be. But, you know, it's a good, it's a good, it's a great rivalry game, right? Like everyone's going to come here. Uh, to compete and, and we took care of business last time when they were here so I, I'm sure there's some vengeance on the table. Is there anything y'all can draw from the experience when they came here uh, two years ago just last time whenever y'all got the win? Series win? I mean I think play the game hard, play the game right. I mean at that that time in conference we were similar to where we are now right that we're just we're just chipping away and trying to get into um, and trying to get in to momentum and and then we took care of Kansas and then we brought that into UT and so you know but the a, a mainstay was the crowd you know that two years ago we sold out that crowd um, and, and it's just different the atmosphere you get to play in when um, when you have your home your home crowd yelling for you and heckling and um, just giving you a hometown advantage and uh, and it's huge so I'm hoping that that gets replicated for sure. And can you just talk about maybe Cassidy and Madison both who have been kind of your main pitchers so far in conference play and just the success that they've had and how hard they've been working? Yeah, I mean, we continue to push both of those guys a ton. You know, we we say decrease walks. We're saying uh, make sure that we get an opportunity to make some plays, uh, keep it in the infield, and they're doing those things. They're hitting their spots, working ahead of counts. Um, they're giving us an opportunity to make some defensive plays, and our defense is making them. So, um, you know, that's exactly – you can't – and, and for it to be a freshman and, and a senior, you can't say enough about Cassidy. Um, she wants the ball. She's competitive as 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 anyone we have, and um, and she's keeping us in some ball games, and she's given us opportunities to win some ball games. And um, I think Maddie's came in and done a really great job keeping them off balance and being able to use them in tandem and not giving up a lot of walks. That's what we were doing early on, just giving up too many walks. And um, and we've really you know tightened the screws right there and and taking care of some things we need to take care of. Yeah, the focus throughout the whole week of practice is make sure every rep counts and uh, just to stay mentally in it through every single minute of practice. And that totally carries over into the game. So I feel like that's that focus and practice is what shows in the game and our success. What's the team chemistry and mentali mentality like heading into Texas? Oh, it's, it's never been better. We're all super pumped to be uh, to have this rivalry series at home and um, especially this last weekend at Kansas, um, that's what we—that's what really got us through that series. To get that win on Sunday too was we were all bonding together and having fun, and that's what made the difference. What are you guys expecting from from Texas this weekend? Um, they're a good team. They have great pitching, and that's what we've been focusing on this week during practice is um, how to best attack their pitchers. So, um, and we're just looking forward to some great competition. That's always the best part. Is there a little extra juice for y'all this week, getting ready to play, you know, in say rival and, you know, expecting huge crowds out there and stuff like that? Is a little extra, extra juice for y'all? For sure. Yeah, definitely. It's just in the energy that we all have in the locker room and in practice. Like, you can just feel it. You know, we're pretty familiar with how they play and they play hard, um, but we're expecting to play harder and win the games. Coach, oh, Coach talked a little bit earlier about just how huge that series win was a couple of years ago here at home, and mm -hmm. um, you know to be able to to look back and to kind of bring that into this weekend. I mean, how much are you guys using that as sort of leverage and and energy going into this series this weekend? Well, you know, we talk about it a lot. You know, hey, you remember that time when we you know did that and did this and when Devin hit that triple, and and we're still almost riding the high two years later. And so I think that we do anything right now to match that. And uh, as a team, we're going to do everything in our power to match that. It's, what does that look like for you guys? I mean, is that uh, just, just focus? Is that 
you know, just being really intentional about a certain area or, or what, what does that look like for you guys? I think it's uh, finding a way to win no matter how you do it. I don't, it, you know, whether you're stealing bases or like here at Miles had a delayed steal the other day, like that, things like that, I'm sure that that's how we're going to win the ball games. Kind of talk about the team's mentality going into this rivalry series. Yeah, so I think we're having the same mentality as we did against the last game against KU. You know, like um, we're good enough to win. And um, as long as, you know, we play with grit and compete like we know how, um, that's kind of the mentality that we go into knowing that that's a foolproof, foolproof way to walk away. Coach mentioned how the pitching has kind of come around now since conference play. And <clears throat> as a catcher, where have you seen the most improvement in, in the pitching staff? I just think that they've gotten so much more consistent. I mean, like, they go out there and they're not afraid. You know, they're not afraid to miss a spot and they're not afraid to hit a spot. And I think that that is huge, uh, something that we've kind of been lacking in the past. And I think that, uh, you know, Cassidy Scott's come in big and she doesn't care how many games she has to pitch. And same with Maddie Mazel, you know, they, they are ready. They want the ball. They want the ball and that's all you can ask.